Royalty has arrived on the Gold Coast for one of the biggest events on the racing calendar. Amber Austin Wright met the Queen's granddaughter Zara Phillips and she joins us now live. Amber, how's her trip been so far? Well, Max, she was greeted with scorching hot conditions, but Zara Phillips does appear to be enjoying the Gold Coast lifestyle so far. She told us it's a nice change from the cold conditions she's used to, but unfortunately she won't get much of a chance to sightsee or relax as she has a full week of commitments at the Magic Millions Carnival. Not that she's complaining. It was a rare sight, horses running to royalty on a Gold Coast beach. But there was Zara Phillips, the Queen's eldest granddaughter and an Olympic equestrian silver medalist. Her newest title is ambassador for the 2013 Magic Millions Race Carnival. And her biggest challenge this week could be getting used to the heat. Um, in a minute I'm going back in the tent. <laughs> um, you know, obviously for me it's nice because it's winter and cold at home. Dressed in jeans and a casual shirt, the 31-year-old was relaxed and approachable. But locals were still in awe. Oh, she's absolutely gorgeous. Closest I've ever been to royalty before, so yeah. Pulling the first barrier draw for Saturday's race, Zara will spend the days ahead at the highly anticipated yearling sales. This event is tipped to be the biggest yet, with 20,000 expected here at the track this Saturday, and the Queen's granddaughter has attracted more international attention than ever. She's taking, she's taking the Magic Millions label to all corners of the globe. It's just wonderful. There's also a generous cash prize up for grabs for the winning horse and its owner. They will be getting the highest prize money ever paid in the history of Queensland. They'll get nearly one and a half million dollars. Hopefully a lady will win. But as for a race to motherhood... Yeah, hopefully in the future, um, you know, we'll see what happens. But, um, you know, we're not sort of putting a date down. <laughs> she says there's no rush for more royal babies anytime soon. Yeah, she told us Kate Middleton would definitely win that race to be a mother. For now, our guest of honour will enjoy her visit to the coast and share her love of horses with the people here. Most people who have met her today have been very impressed and say she's the perfect ambassador for an event like this. OK, thanks to Amber Austin Wright at Surface Paradise.